Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Shernice and welcome back to Simply Nikwa. So today I have a cool nail tutorial that I'm going to do for you guys that I seen on Instagram that, that was done like at a salon and I'm going to show you today that you can do a salon nail tutorial at home. So an at home edition nail salon type of style nail tutorial. So I'm showing you that you can you can do this nail tutorial as well. All you gotta do is dissect it and go step by step for this nail tutorial. So if you want to know what I'm going to um, you know, do for this nail tutorial, sit back and relax and continue watching. But before you continue watching, if you haven't already, go and subscribe to my channel right now. If you like nail tutorials, I do them every week. So go down below and subscribe so you won't miss out and hit that great notification bell so you'll be notified first. And also also, uh, while you're down there, give a like if you like the thumbnail picture already. That's why you clicked on this video. So go ahead and give me a like. Other than that, enjoy watching and let's get started with this video. So for this nail tutorial, I decided to do a, a home edition of how to do nail salon nails that you see on Instagram that you just like scrolling through and see like you wish you could do it if you just don't know how to do it. I'm going to show you this nail design that you can do that's like a nail salon look. So um, I was inspired by these two pictures as you see here and I love them and I love these nails and I love them so I was like huh. I want to show you guys how to do these nails um, at home with regular nail polish and everything else. So first when I want to make the nails have a base color. So on all the nails, since they're all ombre, I'm going to have a white base coat so all the colors would be bright and on and popping. So like I said, all the nails will get a white base coat which I use LA Colors Color Last Evermore and I apply two coats on every nail. So each nail has a different ombre. So I got two makeup sponge wedges for this nail tutorial and we put that to the side. But first, before we do the ombre, I'm going to put the latex tape liquid cuticle guard and put it around there so it's less clean up. But you don't have to do it, it's very optional. You just have to clean up around your cuticles at the end with some nail polish remover. So it's fine, so that's what I'm going to do now. you put that around all the cuticles on, on all the nails and it turns this translucent pink that means it's dry and ready to go so I started with my pinky for the first ombre and this ombre is a blue to green so the blue that I used was Cookie Professionals Atlantis at last and the green I combined with on this one was LA Colors Color Last Energy and I combined those two milked the two in the middle and for all of them I did about two or three dab sessions and yeah Once I was happy with that ombre, I went to the wedding figure, which I use a green and a yellow. So the green I use is LA Colors Color Last Energy that I used a while ago, and then I moved up to the yellow, which I used LA Colors Color Last Upbeat. I love this yellow, and I dabbed that did the dab session on this until I was happy and of the opaqueness of the colors, and yeah. love ombre and it's pretty cool I like to see how the colors melt together so the next ombre that I did on my middle finger I did a, a yellow to orange and for this one I decided to do like you know a three color thing of like a lighter orange to a darker orange you don't have to do it but that's what I did for this one so I used the yellow 
which I used LA Colors Color Last Up Beat. And then the lighter orange that I used was Salon Perfect Orange County Cruising. And then the dark orange that I used was from Pure Ice called Drive Me Crazy. So I applied that onto the Makeup Sponge Wedge, did the dab sessions until I was happy with it, and then I moved on. of ombre that I used on my index finger was the orange and instead of I using the light orange I just went with the darker orange and I used that darker orange and in flowing into a pink so the orange that I used was the pure ice drive me crazy going into the LA colors color last never ending pink meshed them together did the dab sessions and yeah that was lovely last colorway of ombre that I did was on my thumb and which I used that pink going into a purple so I used LA colors color last never ending for the pink going into that purple which I used salon perfect mood ring purple and yeah I did that ombre meshed them together you know that sessions you know the drill to these pictures I decided to do um, like the silver line in the middle and uh, but the, these two were pretty cool and they're inspiration so I decided to do that silver line so with a, a liner brush and right in the middle of the nail one line I applied LA Colors Color Craze called live and I applied that right in the middle and to make sure it's thin, I didn't do the best job of that. But make sure it's thin if you're doing this yourself. But if it's not thin, you know, just go go with the boat. Go with the flow, go with the boat, you know, just it's your nails. And so this is the best opportunity to have some sparkles, some glitter, some moreness to this nail. And um I then on that top of the um, silver part, I applied some holographic glitter, like, yes, it needed the holographic glitter, so in the sun, it just shines. So I used, from Revlon, their holographic pearl glitter, and I applied that right on that silver line. Once I was done with that, I was done with my nails. Um, it, I, it, it, it looked just like the picture, so I was done. And so, the top coat that I used to dry them all is the Perfect Quick Dry High Gloss Top Coat, and I applied that to all of the nails. And so, this is what my nails came out to look like. Not bad, don't you think? It looks just like it. More of a bootleg version, but... So you guys, how do you like my nail salon home edition nails that I did for you guys this week? I showed you, you can do these specific nails on yourself, on your nails. You do it with long nails, short nails. You can do this. It's pretty easy. And I hope you really like this video. And I hope you really learned something. So if you haven't already and you waited to the end of the video, go ahead and go down below and give this a like if you really learned something. If you really like these nails, if you want to like try them yourself and don't want to comment that, you can just go ahead and give me a like. So if you like these kind of videos, let me know by liking this video. But also, if you are not subscribed yet and just 
enjoying this video and you like this video go ahead and subscribe down below because I will be doing nail tutorial videos every week and I do that every week I love doing nail tutorials and all this and showing you how to do this and I just I just love it so I want to you know help you out too also thank you so much for making it to this end of the video I hope you have a great day and I'll catch you back next week with another bye